by now I'm sure you've always already asked yourself, how do I start? How do I make my own story map? What is a map journal story map? Esri and ArcGIS Online have created a number of templates for you to create story maps. There's a landing page for story maps, and you can see it up here in the top left corner here. You can go to, you can Google story maps, Esri, and it will bring you to this landing page. At the top, you'll see there's a link for apps. If you click on apps, it'll show you all the different types of stories you want to tell, and you can see that they've got section for sequential based narratives, how to present a series of maps, how to compare two maps, what to do if you'd like to present just one map to your students or your, or your audience, and then how can you, you can do your own custom map designs. What we've decided to do with this class is to choose the tool that we find most valuable for the classroom, which is the Story Map Journal, because it uses a lot of different skills. It uses map making skills, writing skills and uh, primary and secondary source interrogation. And so what we're going to do is we're going to walk you through um, getting started with uh, the map you've already made, the Civil War map. There are a number of ways to, to get started with your story map and, and to get to the app builder. You can get to the app builder through this site that we've shown you, the story map landing page. Or Esri's made it really easy to work with when you're working with your map in ArcGIS Online. The first piece you need for a story map is the map that you're going to be telling the story about. The reason you need the map for the story map is that you, the app that we're going to be working with communicates with the maps that you've already made and, and it works with those maps uh, to tell the story. So in this situation, the story map topic that we're going to be looking at is the early years of the American Civil War and a tie to the map that you've already made. So we're going to click over here. I've already opened up my content in ArcGIS Online, and you're going to see under my content folder, I have a map titled the American Civil War Demo. We're going to go ahead and open that map up so I can show you what, what all the contents are that we're going to be working with. So we're going to go ahead and open the map. We're going to choose Open, Open in Map Viewer. We'll let it load. And most of this map should look familiar to you. It's the map that you created uh, last week. Um, the few things I've added are map notes to show secession, a map note to show where Fort Sumter is, and a map note to show Bull Run. We're going to use those in the story map. To get to the story map app builder through ArcGIS Online, you choose Share. <clears throat> notice you can choose who you want to share it with, and then you'll notice there's an option down here to create a web app. Over here on the left, you will see a link for Build a Story Map. And you'll notice there's an option for five options. We're going to choose Story Map Journal. We're going to say, yeah, let's go ahead and create an app. It asks you, what would you like to title it? Already on a Word document, I've put the items that I want to title it over here. I'm going to highlight my title. Go back to the screen here, and I'm going to cut and paste this title into the screen. I'm going to use the shortcut, which on a Dell computer or PC is Control B. I'm going to give the map a summary. This is a demo map. The Civil War. I'm just go ahead and save it in my folder, and I'm also going to share it with the same group that's already shared with the map, and I'm going to choose Done. will bring you to the map journal builder and you can choose a side panel or floating panel option. Go ahead and choose start. 
what I'm going to do now is, is stop and let this be the first section of this tutorial, and we'll pick up with the second option in a moment.